Hey guys, in this video today, I will show you how you can connect a Bluetooth mouse to your iPhone. And it's actually a little bit hidden, but I will show you how you can activate this. So the very first step, you have to make sure that the Bluetooth connection with your Bluetooth mouse and your iPhone is set. So I come here to my mouse and I turn this one on and I have a setting here on number three and I bring it in pairing mode. So you have to check how you can bring this in pairing mode. This is the Logitech MX Master 2 and I can just hold the button here on the bottom until this number is blinking. Now it's blinking, so I can come in here to the Bluetooth settings. And now here under the Bluetooth settings, here I will see the MX Master 2S. So now it will ask me to pair, Bluetooth pairing request. I say pair, and now my Bluetooth mouse is connected. But nothing works so far, because we have to do another step. We have to activate this now here for our iPhone. And by the way, I'm using an iPhone 16 Pro, but I also tested this with the iPhone 13 Pro. So it's an iOS thing and not just an iPhone thing. But let me know in the comments if you find any troubles, if that doesn't work for you. So what I will do is now I come back here to the settings. I have to scroll down until I see accessibility. And here under accessibility, we find here under physical and motor, the top one is called touch. So I go to touch and now the top one is assessive touch. You have to activate assessive touch. This will open this little here, what you can use if, if do you remember back when we had the home button and when the home button was broken, you could use this button here to navigate your iPhone. So somehow with the latest versions update, the iOS 18 updates, they hide the pointer now in this assessive touch. I haven't figured out another way. So if you know another way, please let me know in the comments. But in if you still have iOS 17, you can use this feature without even activating the assessive touch. Because now when this is active, look at this. I have my mouse. I can now use the pointer here, like on an iPad, and I can navigate through my iPhone with a mouse, a Bluetooth mouse. And the cool thing is you can also connect, of course, a Bluetooth keyboard. So when I turn this keyboard here on, if I now go into my Bluetooth here, now this is the setting for my Nufi keyboard. Pairing request, yes, pair, it's the same like with, with the mouse. Now my mouse is connected and my keyboard is connected. If we open the notes, for example, I can use my keyboard on my iPhone. And if I open a game, like for example, Minecraft, I can now use the mouse here inside and I can also use the keyboard to navigate through. It kind of works. I can use my mouse and my keyboard for playing, but it kind of is annoying. It's not the same like on the iPad because I have this mouse on top of the mouse here inside all the time. And if you want to change the color of your mouse, because I turned it now here into green, come here to the settings, accessibility again, and now scroll down until you find pointer control. And that is the funny thing. This setting, pointer control, only will show you when you activate assessive touch. If assessive touch is off, you will not see the pointer control. Now I can go to this one and for example here, increase the contrast, or I can also change the color to any color that I like here, blue, green, red. If you don't like any color, you can use this one that's very subtle. I like green, so if I make a video here on YouTube, you can see my mouse. You can also increase the scrolling speed and the pointer size. I can make this pointer even bigger or make it smaller. So that's up to you. So yes, you can use a mouse. Is it as good as on the iPad? Not yet. If you play games, let me know if you find a game where it's maybe even better that you can use it. Technically, we can connect a keyboard that works really well. You don't have to activate anything and you can connect a mouse but it doesn't work as seamless as on the iPad so far. That's it from this video. I'm Daniel. If you found this helpful and you learned something, let me know in the comments. Hit like, subscribe, dingle dingle the bam bang gong, and we see us in the next video. I'm Daniel. Bye.